Do y'all even like recognize his face? It's been a very long time. It seems like probably over a month. I, I couldn't even tell you. Uh, I Here's my explanation, and I'll leave it at that. Your boy had got busy. Simple. Your boy had got busy. I had trips here, there, here, there, and I had to focus on the main channel. Well, obviously, no more trips. <laughs> I mean, where am I going to go? People telling me to stay in the crib. So I haven't gone anywhere, and I missed the game of basketball so much. I've been watching so many highlights. I got this thing going on on Twitter. If you follow me there, where I'm like, Tweeting out highlights of just random, random NBA players. We did Jamal Tinsley, Meta Okor, Roger Roberson. Just the most random NBA players you can think of. I'm sitting here watching their highlights and clipping them and putting them on Twitter. So I was like, if I'm just going to watch highlights anyway because we don't have basketball, I might as well bring back KLT for q React. So I'm going to try my hardest to keep this going just because there's no hoops. And the only hoops we can get are these highlight channels. So shout out to everybody clipping highlights and everything. Today's video, we have NBA wow moments. Moments that make you say, wow. So let's see if I say, wow. <laughs> Leave a like on the video, by the way, because we're back. Um, and share it with your friends. I mean, we're watching highlights. We all love basketball, don't we? I know this moment. And this is a moment that definitely made me say, wow, watching it live. Every little thing had to go correct for this to happen. Literally everything had to go correct for this to happen. I think they end up losing this game in OT. Jason Tatum had to miss it perfectly. James Harden had to miss it perfectly. Marcus Smart had to continue to be a bull. Jalen Brown had to be able to catch that and shoot it on the fly. Everything had to be perfect, and it made me say, wow, one for one. This one is Steph Curry, first game back. That is that is a wow type moment. But the craziest thing is, that's not even the craziest shot Steph Curry has hit in recent history. I would love to say welcome back, but obviously none of us are watching or playing basketball, so I can't even say welcome back. Steph Curry, that's that's a nasty shot, though. Okay. This is a Russell Westbrook dunk down the lane. First of all, Montrez Harrell is so undersized. They call it a block, which is beautiful. I mean, it'll make, a, make it feel a lot better if they weren't losing by 20. Shout out to Montrez. Um, shout out to Montrez for being able to, being willing to try to stop Russell Westbrook at the rim like that. Because not many people will jump in front of Russell Westbrook. That's all I'm saying, because you will end up on a poster. Oh, he just Oh, he didn't inbound it? Yes. Okay. So I'm happy that these wow moments aren't just, like, game winners and stuff. It's just moments. Like, this is a wow moment because LeBron's, like, the greatest to ever do it. And he, he didn't inbound the ball. I love this jersey. I love these courts. And this is when he tried to go under Cal Lowry. I mean, uh, under. <laughs> Cal Lowry tried to go under George Hill, bro. What was he doing? I don't understand it. Like, like, no, 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 no. Let's think about this. Where was this man's intention on that play? You know he got the caboose. The caboose is not going to make it between George Hill's legs. Come on, man. Like, like what? And he looked at the ref like, okay, is this George Hill foul? No, you're being weird. So what we got here? James Harden with the ball down by 10 against the Charlotte Hornets. He gives it up to Jeff Green. I'm so confused on what's what, what are we wowing about? The the wow moment was the call. He got a quadruple double with turnovers. Next, I just, I've never seen that one. I ain't seen that one. Terrence Davis is one of those dudes that I really like watching, man. I got like a rookie card where he, he with his autograph on it. Shout out to Terrence Davis, man. Very underrated player coming into the season. Obviously, he's he went undrafted. He's been making himself known though. Making himself known. And that's why I was so happy when KLT Frick you got drafted to the Raptors, if you know, you know. Uh Rondo. Nice pass to Cal Kuzma. The, that's the flukiest. That's the flukiest. Slim Shady Kuzma. Like it's like he got stripped. And it goes in. It sure like a pretty good shot. He should just do that more often than Lakers fans probably won't be on his head as much. For real. Okay, back to Boston. Jalen Brown got Matisse on him. Matisse is that defender. But, whoa. Yeah, you heard me. I, I didn't say wow, but I said whoa. Jalen Brown, mixtape season. And that's a very good defender he did it to. Wow. Yeah, that's a wow moment. Oh, wait, wait. Okay, what am I? What am I? This moment, okay, 
I had to be at this game, y'all. I had to be at this game. I am a Bulls fan with season tickets. What happened on this play? I don't know. Oh, my God. I'm a fake fan, aren't I? All right. Let's play it. Oh, the time out by Jim Boylan on the break. It's like uh, 50 degrees in my basement, so I got like this blanket down here. You know what? We're just going to ignore it. I don't even want to wait on it. Uh, luckily, we end up winning this game. But, like, you just took two points off the board. And even Luca was laughing at this one, right? Right? Yeah, Luca was laughing at this one. Because, like, we just got two points that were taken off the board because Coach went to call timeout. Fire that man. Look, Luca laughing at him because that's incompetence. All right, Kawhi Leonard got P.J. Tucker on him. Shaking him up a little bit. And the dunk. Kawhi's story is crazy. Kawhi's story crazy, man. Shout out to Kawhi. Makes me want to better my craft because he better his craft. Like, that's something Kawhi couldn't do five years ago. Just, like, being able to dribble like that. Between his legs twice, I've always been able to jump. Okay, first off to start the game, what's the wow moment? Neither of them got the ball. <laughs> that's That ain't a great start. That, that definitely ain't a great start. But at least, at least Anthony Davis is laughing about it because he knows that that's crazy. LeBron was not laughing, though. Okay, we have Lou Will. Sweet Lou. That's, I mean, that looks like a normal rim grazer because it kind of is, but it's Lou Williams doing it. Because, you know, he's kind of he's kind of up there in age, and he's also just like six foot. So to see him dunk is pretty good. Lonzo. Yes, Alex Caruso catching him at the rim. Yeah. I guess it is Caruso City. It used to be Lonzo City, but no, it's Caruso City, man. Shout out to Alex Caruso. Fan favorite in the around the world, not just here. Luca and one. And one Luca. Come on, man. Come on. I think I think Corey Joe is laughing because he knows how fluky that is. Like, there's nothing you can do about it. That's just a lucky shot right there. What, what, what can you do about it? And luckily, it's early in the game. So, at the end of the day, this these two points may not have mattered too much. Zion with the free throw miss, got his own board, and went back up. Oh. He is strong. He probably missed the second free throw, too. I'm just, I'm just being honest. That's kind of what he do. But, yeah. I think I saw something on Reddit that said, like, a lot of percentage of Zion's misses are rebounded by Zion, and he goes back up with them. Like, he just gets his own rebound. Like, he's just padding his offensive rebounding stats. Back to Boston. A lot of wild moments happen in Boston, it seems like. Marcus Smart, what you got to do with this ball? Good pass. Okay. Okay. I never really noticed that this man wears the number 43. It's a very weird number, but he plays in Boston, and pretty much every number is retired in Boston. So you got to make it what you got. And 43 is the number this man's wearing right now. It's just not a good basketball-looking number. Shout out to Green, though. Javante, right? Javante? Oh. This is two times in one video. It had to be a, a, adding an error, but that's fine. It is a wow moment. Two times wow. Two times wow. Yeah, unless he just had a play very similar. And he just edited them apart from each other. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, this is uh, this is LeBron's like fadeaway post for the game. Basically, he iced the game with this one. Yep. This was a good game on that Sunday, man. Wow, I miss basketball so much, bro. Sunday showcases, Thursday nights, uh, everything, every night, basically. All right, what do we have here? Jokic being double teaming. That's off. Cody Martin. I think that might be the other Martin brothers. Both of them. Number 10 and number 11, they identical twins. I, I get them mixed up. Off his back for a bucket. Was that Jamal, Jamal Murray? I think that was Jamal. No, it wasn't Jamal Murray. Okay. It was Will Barton. Shout out to Will Barton. I was about to say, Jamal Murray, I ain't trying to, trying to think about Jamal Murray right now. No, no, no. Ja. He tried it. Shout out to Anthony Davis risking his body. Draws the offensive foul, but I'm pretty sure the Lakers end up losing this game. Pretty sure the Lakers end up losing this game, like bad too. And I'm pretty sure it was LeBron's first game back after missing a game. If I'm not mistaken. 
But that's a great charge drawn by AD. But another body trying to be taken by Ja. Mixtape. Mixtape, Mr. Ferg. Twisting and turning. Kind of an awkward shot. Wow. A dozen for Kawhi Leonard. Okay. I mean, I guess technically that could be a wow moment. It's just like, he's so stiff with everything he does. But he just, he makes it work. He just makes it work. The pass. I was calling him in Pele for like the first... Oh, until just this moment. But I just heard his name was Pell. Um, somebody on Instagram literally DM'd me saying, Kenny, what do you think about Nor... What's his name? Norvell Pell, I guess? Layup is twice. Man missed two. He blew Not two easy layups. Come on, dog. I understand potentially missing the first one, Jokic but the second one too. Oh, shout out to Jokic for this one. In. They got blown out this game, but that's Jokic a great shot. That's a great shot. Even the Clipper fans ooing on that one. That's a good shot. Is it a wild shot? Would I say it's a wild shot? Probably not, but it is a it is a good one. It is a good one. Next one. I grew up with this guy. Trey Young. Oh yes, yes. When I I didn't watch this game live, but when I saw it, you know, H O H. Shout out to House of Highlights. I was like, come on, Trevor Reza, bro. Don't be don't be like this. Oh, you feel so disrespected that the young dude went between your legs. Get don't let him do it then. That's not what you do. And I think at the end of the game they talked and it's all it's all cool now. But like that's not how you do things. Yes. Okay. 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 This was a wild moment because I remember watching this one. This is an, a very obvious goal to him I really go bear. And because of the support of the Trailblazer lost, because you can't review you can't review those plays because nothing was called. And that was the second time this season Rudy Gobert got away with a game-winning goal 10. Zion just ripped it from him. That's a wow moment? Oh, Zion is strong. Okay, we get it. Zion is strong. Is that wow, though? I guess it kind of is because it's Giannis. It's against Giannis. It's not just some random guy. Okay, that is a wow moment. Shout out to Zion, man. Shout out to Zion. Okay. Those were the wow moments. I see smartest plays with a Chris Paul. Hey, fam. We may have to hit that one up in the future. Hold on. Can I add it to the list? I'm going to add it to the list. If you enjoyed the video, leave it a like. Uh, We're we trying to do our reactions pretty often around here. So, I'll be back soon.